Ron Paul's message of peace and civil liberty is bringing people together from all parts of the political spectrum. But to have Ron Paul as a choice for president in 2012, you need to help him get the Republican nomination first. There are a few things you'll need to understand to make this happen. In August 2012, the Republican Party will hold a national convention in Florida in which delegates will officially vote for a Republican nominee to run against Barack Obama. Each state has its own process for electing these delegates, either through a caucus system, as in these states, or a primary system, as in these states. Caucuses and primaries are either open, meaning that you do not have to be registered Republican to vote for Ron Paul to be the Republican nominee for president, or closed, meaning that you do have to be registered Republican. Let's look at the primary states first. If you live in one of these states, you're in a primary state. In a primary election, registered voters may participate in choosing their candidate by voting in a secret ballot as in a general election. The specific rules and methods for voting for the Republican presidential nominee vary among states, but in each case your state will send delegates to the national convention to support the candidate that gets the most votes in the primary. But whichever state you're in, you have to show up at the right time on the right date with as many blue Republicans as you can to vote for Ron Paul. In states with closed primaries, you will need to be registered as a Republican in order to vote for Ron Paul in the Republican primary. The deadlines to change your party affiliation to Republican differ from state to state. But some of these deadlines are many months before the primary. So if you live in one of these states, your most immediate concern should be changing your party affiliation to Republican. Deadline dates can be found at bluerepublican.org. If you live in one of these other primary states, you do not have to worry about party affiliation, as these are either open or blanket primaries. In other words, just show up. Now let's look at the caucus states. If you live in one of these states, you're in a caucus state. Just as if you live in a primary state, you must determine if the caucuses are open or closed. If closed, you must register Republican in time to be allowed to vote in the caucus. Think of a caucus as a tournament for delegates. Your county is divided up into various precincts. Each one holds a caucus. In your caucus, people from your neighborhood will stand and announce their desire to go to the county convention as a delegate. You'll have to identify those people who support Ron Paul and vote for them. If there isn't a supporter for Ron Paul at your caucus, you will have to stand and become the delegate for him. Those chosen at the caucus will go on to the county convention to compete to be a delegate to the state convention and finally to the national convention where they will vote for Ron Paul. The caucus system is a bit more work than the primary system, but in it, one dedicated supporter can have the same impact as tens of thousands of voters. Often, a Republican neighborhood caucus will have no turnout, especially in more liberal parts of the country. This is a great opportunity for blue Republicans to have a massive impact. Just a handful of blue Republicans in the right places will get Ron Paul the nomination. Remember, in these situations, you will have to vote yourself to be the delegate to advance to the county level and then network with the Ron Paul people there. There are many in the Republican Party that will not welcome blue Republicans or Ron Paul supporters of any kind. They may try to discourage or intimidate you. So bring as many friends as possible, stay positive, and have a great time sticking it to the establishment. You know you'll like it. Again, here's the list of states. If you live in one colored blue, you're in a closed state and must register Republican as soon as possible. If you live in one colored green, you do not, but don't forget to go to the primary or caucus on the right day. Finally, how do you go about changing your registration? In many states, you can do it online. In others, it's a bit more tricky. You can find detailed information about registering Republican in your state on the bluerepublican.org page. If we mobilize enough people, the Ron Paul Nation will be able to punch above its weight at the National Convention in Florida 2012. So please, for the sake of liberty and peace, tell others about Ron Paul and send them links to the Blue Republican page and this video.